don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. Hey, don't forget to subscribe. Okay. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Corley and today I'm here to do a Ice Queen makeup look. Have an idea in my head, hopefully it turns out well. That's what I'm trying to do. And it's like an Ice Queen cold um, goddess winter princess. So I'm gonna do a blue look. I don't necessarily live for blue on my eyes, but I want to like it more. So you know. So I'm gonna take the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Concealer in the shade 07 Natural. And I'm just gonna prime my eyelids with this. So I'm gonna prime my eyes and then we'll go right into the eyeshadow. Now that this eye is primed, I'm gonna try a technique um, that I saw on um, at Miranda Blake 41 on Instagram and Twitter. And um, I'm gonna create a cut crease shape because you know, who's a queen? without a cut crease. From my Beige Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette, I'm gonna take this shade right here. And I am gonna trace the shape of the cut crease I want with a super fine line brush, because why not? Okay, so I traced the line. This is the shape of cut crease I want. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take this e.l.f. detail crease brush. It's a really tiny little like crease brush, super small. And I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take a mix from these two palettes. So I'm gonna take this shade from the Morphe 35B, and I'm gonna take this shape right here from the BH Cosmetics, take me back to Brazil. And I'm gonna like blend out this line. You guys are gonna. Her method, I saw it on her pictorial and I was like, damn. Now to blend out this blue, I'm gonna take this shade from the BH Cosmetics, take me back to Brazil palette. And, uh, and yeah, and my BH Cosmetics marble number nine brush. Now what I'm going to do is go in with the blue red here from the Morphe 35B, this one here, and I'm just going to reline the crease and reapply all of the shades to really work on the intensity of the eyeshadow. I'm going to take the NYX Vivid Brights Creme Color in the shade uh, Blueprint, this one. I used it in um, my last video when I was trying a bunch of like new drugstore releases. And I'm gonna take my Real Techniques Fine Liner Brush and I'm gonna like line the cut crease. Why am I doing this? The more extra, the better. You can't see it on the um, screen, or can you? I don't know, you can't see it on camera. Or maybe you can and I can't see it in the viewfinder. Hopefully you can see it, but um, now okay so all that to say that I'm gonna do the other eye off camera and I will be right back to do my base this has turned out <laughs> banging I really like this this is nice it's nicer in my mirror because I can see the actual line I did with this but um oh well it's good. see you okay Okay guys, we're back. I snatched both these eyes and now we're gonna do the base. So I'm gonna first start using the Tatcha, the Silk Canvas Primer. By the way guys, I've been trying out new skincare products. So um, I'm seeing results, but it's only been like two nights, right? I use them for like two nights, but well two days. So we'll see. But it's looking really promising for what it is, which makes me extremely excited. For foundation, I will be taking the Too Faced Born This Way Undetectable Medium to Full Coverage Oil Free Foundation. 
And then for concealer, I'm going to take the um, Too Faced Born This Way Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer. I'm not done watching Bird Box. I just want, like, that movie makes me so anxious. I can't watch it, like, all in one go. Like, I watch 10 minutes and I'm like, oh my god. The concept is good, but, like, mass suicide? Oh, hell no. This eye look is nice. I'm not, a, like, a blue person, but it's cute. I like it. My face is really like powdery looking. Let her be, please. Thank you so much. We're gonna now take the white from the Morphe 35B, the white, okay? I'm not gonna lift it up and show you. And I'm gonna go ahead and highlight my inner corners. Well, lay a base more so. Because this white is not the most powerful white, but it's actually playing in our favor. Okay, it's pretty powerful if you do pack it. But I'm laying a white base because we're gonna draw um, a snowflakes. A, a snowflakes? No, no, no. A snowflakes in our inner corner. I'm gonna take the NYX SFX cream color. This is the face paint, it's in the shade white. I mean, I need a photo of a snowflake, darling. We're gonna go for something approximately like this. Mm. And I'm basically gonna draw that in my inner corner. So we're gonna do this, and then we're gonna do... Like, I don't know if you saw what I did, but I just created like little, little like... Almost as if it's an hour pointing in, right? If you're asking why I'm not gonna use the um, the NYX white liquid liner, is because this little dumb ugh, it cracks, oh, and I don't like when things crack. So that's why I took a lot of product on my hand of the cream pin and I warmed it up because I know she won't crack on me. Thank you. Yeah, it's looking like a snowflake. Thank Jesus. Boom. Oh, this is so cute! I'm so good at this sometimes. Yeah, I'm gonna do the other thing on the other inner corner and I will be right back. Even though we are ice queens and kings, no discrimination here, we still must bronze. So I'm gonna take my ABH powder bronzer in the shade Rich Amber. I like the fact that it's called Rich and Amber. I like both of these things. Yeah, was I going to go to work with an inner corner um, snowflake? Yes, I was. Let's bake. We love a nice lifted cheek. I look like the Joker. What's new? This off blush palette, I'm gonna take this ooh, light pink shade right here because it's icy. What if the haters wanna fight me? No, it's because it's a cool tone of pink. This is the shade I've used the least because I don't do a lot of like cool tone looks to be very honest with you. I always say this to people but I'm a very like warm tone orange red. I'm a fire sign and Aries. Therefore I like really like warm shades. Oh yeah. Your ice queen, you know she's been outside, her nose is a little red. It's all part of the act. Okay, so for highlight, I'm gonna take this highlighter because I feel like it's a neutral highlighter. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills X Amorizi Highlight and this is stunning. Like, look at this, look at this. Like, it's so glazed. It's like not even, can you see? It's not even like a highlight, it's like a sheen. I love it. We're gonna buff this whole face in before we set, so. I always make sure I do this because I blend upward. It makes it so that the line is not too harsh, but also so that it helps blend blush, highlight, and bronzer. I'm gonna take the Makeup Forever Artist Color Pencil in the shade Wherever Walnut, and I'm gonna try to highlight. I'm gonna take the Smashbox Stepping Out Liquid Lipstick. Uh, I'm gonna put some mascara and lashes on and I'll be right back to finish the look, okay? This is it guys, I'm wearing the Celeste Los Angeles lashes in this style, cookie, and um, this is the final ice queen look, like icy wifey, haters wanna fight me, don't try me, honey, 
But um, yeah, this is the look. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Also, leave a comment down below telling me other video suggestions or things that you'd like to see me do. Like, girl, please, just help me. Like, truly, from the bottom of my heart, just help me. Sometimes it's hard, you know, we don't get ideas. And we need a little extra someone to give us the idea. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media, such as Instagram and Twitter. I'll have all the links in the description box down below. I know you guys love my Twitter. I'm always a little shady, extra shady one here. My Instagram is popping. You get those pics. The, oh, the, you get the pics, you feel me? So you should probably follow me on there too. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.